My name is Tiffany Chen. I did my PhD in biomedical informatics at Stanford, which is a combination of computer science and biomedicine. We use that, we do that all on HTML. I'm director of informatics at Cytobank Inc. We're a big data SaaS-based platform, um, and scientists basically use our platform to analyze their single cell data to get better information on getting therapies to patients faster. The scientific researchers upload their data to our cloud, and then they generate new findings, including really interesting data visualizations to understand biological populations. You may have the best algorithm, but if you can't visualize it and communicate it, then it's useless. So a critical solution that Cytobank provides is that we make complex algorithms and machine learning methods easy for scientists to use and understand. So researchers use the Cytobank platform to investigate all types of disease, from autoimmune disorders to cancer. What these findings enable is better care for patients and better drug development. Here is actually a minimum spanning tree. Once a week I still collaborate with teams here at Stanford, focusing on both drug discovery as well as ovarian cancer. This not only allows me to directly contribute to the science, but also gain perspective on how Cytobank software is being used and think about new methods that could be developed. So here we are at the Nolan Lab at Stanford, and basically this is where I did a lot of my work during my PhD, where I did all of my biological experiments. One of the advantages of coupling both computer science with other fields is the ability to apply those computational methods and algorithms to many different disciplines. Part of the advantage of being interdisciplinary is you can see the big picture when nobody else can. And not only can you see the big picture, but you can actually communicate to everybody else what that big picture is. I am glad I got a PhD. The PhD affords you a different way of looking at the world. Making it through a PhD really teaches you to become an independent researcher, and that combines a number of skills, meaning problem solving, technical skills, communication skills, how to communicate the work, and talk to a broader audience about what you do. If you're interested in a PhD, I would suggest doing a summer research experience as an undergraduate, but also an internship in industry. This will not only afford you the ability to understand how to do research in academia, but see how these problems can be solved also in real world situations.